Hey everyone, welcome back to Cooking Grizzly. So today I'm gonna throw in uh, one of my own recipes into the batch and see how you guys like it. So today I decided I'm gonna do my version of a grilled ham and cheese sandwich with a special little twist. So without further ado, let's get right into it. First up, olive oil. Sourdough bread. Your preference on bread, but I believe sourdough is the best for grilled, like grilled cheese, grilled ham. So. Right. Jesus. Honey cured ham. Uh, I recommend don't buy the like the pre-packaged stuff. Go to like an actual deli or um, I'm gonna say meat store, but I know that's not the right name. But so you can actually get good ham, it, along with the cheese that I'm gonna show next. It really makes a difference. Gently, gently. Nice. So I got some smoked gouda. What is this one? Sharp cheddar. Right, you know, I'm just gonna grab these. Got some pepper jack, and lastly, Havarti. So these two are gonna combine, and the Gouda and Swiss cheddar are gonna combine. So these are the cheeses I'm gonna use for my sandwiches. Um, again, it's up to your preference on what you wanna use, but this is a good combination. Give it a good, well, give it a try. And lastly is my special twist. <laughs> and lastly is my special twist to the sandwich. And it's where'd you go? Oh, why'd you come over here? The special ingredient. How are you doing this? Where are you? Wait, wait, wait! Don't go. Look how how. Say the secret ingredient. Oh, you're not getting away this time. I bet you're wondering, where is this video going? But as the food lord Guy Fieri always says, we're going to Flavortown. It's bacon. Preset your oven to 400. Hey, welcome back. Okay, so let's get back to business here. So here's what I'm gonna have. While the oven is preheating, I'm gonna, I drop out my cookie sheet. I'm gonna oil it down with that olive oil. Also gonna make sure both sides of the bread has some oil on it before I put it in. And I got my, my frying pan that I can cook my bacon on. Now for the bacon, I'm gonna cook it about 70% of the way through. Um, I don't want it crispy, um, but again, it's up to your preference on bacon. I know some people like it burnt, some people barely like it cooked. I like kind of in the medium. Um, but gotta remember, it's going into the oven, so it's gonna cook some inside too, so take that, take that into account. All right, so let's get started. So first up, put my honey cured ham. about three or four slices. I'm a big boy, so <laughs> probably more than I should. So this is the sharp cheddar and gouda. Havarti and pepper jack. Going with another sharp cheddar and my boy Gouda. <laughs> I don't even know why I put the tops on. I still gotta put the bacon. Just follow along with me, guys. It's all good. It'll turn out in the end. Bacon's about 
about where I want it, so I'm gonna take it off the key. Open up this baby again. Each sandwich gets two luscious pieces of bacon. sandwiches. Why, thank you for asking. Yes, there are three sandwiches. I'm going to keep one without bacon. Alright, let's pop these bad boys in the oven and I'm going to put them for about 10 minutes or until the cheese is melted enough to my liking. So, let's pop these bad boys in. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful. Mm. Let's give it a go. It is so good. I can't tell you just how well all these flavors work together. Both the Harbati, 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 and the sharp cheddar. Let me try the pepper, or, oh, I'm getting all these two mixed up, but. No, I won't lie to you. Is this meal good for you? Not in the slightest. But is it good for you? Oh yeah, it is. I literally can't figure any way I can improve this. In my opinion, it's perfect just the way it is. It's exactly how I want it. It's perfect. So, if you want to follow this, please. These combination of flavors is amazing, but change it to how you like it. So, if you were still here, thank you for watching this far. I had a lot of fun doing this video. It's, it was very quick, but very delicious. So, if you like what you saw, give me a like, a follow, hit the bell to know when I post videos, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.